this video, I'm going to be walking you through step-by-step -step how I'm using AI and Go High Level to not only book more sales appointments for myself, but also for my clients. Now, before we jump into the step-by-step -step tutorial, check this out. This is a video here showing you exactly how the AI conversation would look like in a real case scenario. They said it is, who is this? We offered them our offer. Can I text you our availability? They did an answer. We followed up with them using AI. Again, they did an answer. We then followed up the next day, again, with AI. And then they asked, what times do you have available for Tuesday? We only have one opening. Again, this is all AI generated. That won't work. Here's some availability. And then they went back and forth. They confirmed it. And then again, they went ahead, booked the time, sent a confirmation text asking if it's correct or not. And then that way the appointment was fully booked. So now that you've seen exactly how this flow can work and how seamless it is for AI to text and book meetings for your company, as well as for your clients, I'm going to walk you through this step-by-step -step tutorial so you can implement it and take this key lesson away. So taking a look back, you see we're taking their name, email, phone number, as well as company name. This is for my company. We then get them to submit it. After that, we then get them to click the next button. As you can see here, it says, wait, you're not done. Hit the button below to see how this offer and how our guarantee works. P.S. We have a gift for you as well. Now, one thing I want to mention here, just in terms of marketing, is you've got to think of marketing in the following. Imagine you are a sexy, beautiful lady and you are trying to attract the man of your dreams. Obviously, you are not going to show them everything at once because that's just a little bit too much. Instead, you're going to look good on the front end and then you are going to seduce them to the next step where you're then going to reveal a bit more. Then you go to the next step and then you reveal a bit more until finally they see everything that you have to offer, which is typically on the sales call where you go for the close. So this is a perfect analogy in terms of marketing, because again, you don't want to show everything right off the bat. You want to pique their interest, get them to the next step, show them a bit more, get them more interested, get them to the next step, and then eventually get them on a sales call where you show everything and go for the close. So analogy aside, that step one is you are going to go ahead, you are going to generate the lead. We like using Facebook lead forms. You are then going to send them to a landing page, and this is how I like to structure our landing pages. So right off the top, we're calling out our UA target audience. Let's go on mobile because most people actually use mobile. So again, are you a target audience? So that could be dentist, chiropractor, restaurant owner, whatever it may be. You are then going to restate your offer, get X offer per month or guarantee. So that could be, you know, get 20 new appointments per month or you don't pay. Or that could look like get 50 new clients a month or the next month is free, whatever your offer is and whatever your guarantee is. Again, restate that bold so they can see it. I like to add, yes, you will get this in writing. I've AB tested this and this actually increased the amount of calls we booked because again, it shows that you're willing to be transparent and it shows that you are not actually a scam. We then get them with a call to action, schedule your free strategy call. We then show them that you will get a free valuable bonus, whether that's a sales script, whether that's anything of value that that company can get, show them the value of it. So then now you are again intriguing them to take the next step, which is book that call with you. We then have these nice arrows that are rocking back and forth, get their eyes down to this here, where they're going to go ahead and book the call. Uh, if they continue and they don't book the call, we then show them some results and some testimonials where we're going to go back. Uh, we then have a nice FAQ board, got a question, what do you guys do? Do you guys work with this audience only? How much does it cost? How do you pre-qualify appointments? Are these exclusive appointments? Do you guys guarantee results? Again, so you're going to be able to answer a few FAQs. And then again, one more time, another call to action. What are you waiting for? Schedule your free strategy call where if you don't get more appointments, leads, sales, ROAS, whatever your offer is. Uh, ours is you simply won't pay. We have a full refund in place just to remove the risk. So again, for us, it's you won't pay, but for you, it could be, you know, get another month free or whatever it is. We then have the beautiful rocking arrows down again, down to the calendar where they can go ahead and schedule the call. Now, this is again, our funnel and our ideal scenario where someone is going to book a call themselves. But if they don't, Right now, we're going to dive into our automations, showing you exactly how we're engaging with the AI. So this is our automation here, where once they go ahead, they submit that lead form. We have some stuff where we then wait seven minutes. We text them. If they answer, we then go down to the AI appointment booking bot, where you saw exactly how that conversation goes. It's going to try to send them sometimes, get them booked. If they don't answer, the bot times out. We then follow up with them again, and then we continue to do this in a subsequent manner where we're eventually trying to get them to schedule a call. Now, implementing this specific workflow has allowed me to increase our bookings by an average of six per week and for our clients, an insane amount of extra sales bookings that have led to an insane amount of extra deals closed all by utilizing AI. 
Now, I do want to show you something as well, just in case they do book that call. Obviously, you don't want the AI to engage with him. That would be silly and self redundant. It would probably piss them off and they'd be like, what the hell's wrong with this company? So if they do go ahead and they book that appointment, we then remove them from that workflow completely. That way, the AI is not going to generate. So that's why we have that seven minute wait step where we're giving them seven minutes before we kick the AI in for them to schedule their own appointment. And if they don't schedule an appointment within the first seven minutes, the AI will. But if they do schedule, within the first seven minutes as you can see here we will remove them from that past workflow that way the ai is not going to follow up and bug them i've now taken this exact framework and given it steroids by implementing it into all of our clients accounts but obviously with ai there's always going to be some sort of issue so we've actually added another service into our offer that allows us to look more valuable which is the following so this is called Eliza, which is a platform built by Go High Level that allows you, the agency owner, to take all of your sub accounts, which just means all of your clients' accounts, take all of their messages and streamline them into Eliza. So if you take a look here again, we have all of these leads on the left hand side. We then have the conversation in the middle and then we have some extra information on the right where now we have a dedicated appointment center that is monitoring all of our clients leads and these AI conversations. That way, if the AI does have a mistake, it does have an issue. The appointment center is going to kick the AI out. They are going to jump in, text that lead to then schedule the appointment themselves. This has really allowed us to step our game up in terms of the services that we're providing for our clients. Again, we now have an appointment setter that we've 10x their workload all by giving them AI to help out. So they're now moving into a monitoring phase where they're just monitoring all these conversations and making sure that there's no issues. And if there is an issue, they can then jump in. This means that one appointment setter has literally 10x the volume of clients that they're able to service all while keeping our cost of goods sold much, much lower. All right, guys, real quick, if you want a copy of my agency snapshot, make sure to hit the link in the description and join the waiting list. I'm taking my entire agency snapshot and all of our systems and turning it into a white label product for you completely for free. So again, if you want to grab my structure, my systems, including funnels, automation, AI booking bot settings, and everything else, make sure to hit the link down below and join the waiting list.